affected your overall morning team as well. Uh, I, I, to be honest, I only popped into uh, to wind Dave up with that uh, with that Romulan gag this morning. That cracked me up. <laughs> there you go. Um, and uh, as for Paul, I don't know who Paul is, but I'm just down the road from you, uh, Paul. Uh, a bit, uh, a bit close to the Ambrose in that area. I just... Yeah, no problem, Trevor. Yeah, I used to be on years ago. Um, my handle, I think, was Danger Mouse at that time, and uh, my family was uh, Big Dipper. Uh, God, there used to be a few that I used to speak to. Uh, so it's nice to get on here again. Yeah, um, I don't know how long you've been in Duncan Street, but I remember uh, Kev. A uh, sharp knife from Duncan Street. I don't know if you were around in that particular time. Um, he's up in Dalton now. But, um, yeah, I wonder why the signal was so nice, uh, uh, Paul. You'd like to say, you're on the doorstep, really. Yeah, I'm on here. I'm sat in a transit high top as well, so it's not in the house or anything. So it's uh, fairly high and it's, uh, you know, it's the, the way I can operate at the minute rather than having it in the house. Sure, yeah. I'd be impressed to see you put a transit high top in your house, mate. <laughs> I'd like to try. <laughs> there you go. Anyway, I'm going to back out again. Like I say, I don't very often come down here, but uh, yeah, nice to hear the white noise for a change. Um, wish you best 73s, everyone, or um, 1010 or whatever it is you used to say on here. <laughs> and uh, I'll uh, give Dave the microphone and I'll uh, I'll back out. 73s there, uh, Dave. And uh, nice picture, mate. Crack me up, that. Oh, give it in. For God's sake, we'll never get a talk. <laughs> I'll just check I've got it. Oh dear, yeah, it did crack me up there, Trevor. I did like that, the uh, the wrong, and it does look like it. Good grief, eh? I blame my mother. She said, literally put a ball on me head and cut round it, mate. I'd never forgive her for that. But yeah, nice to hear you, buddy. <laughs> and uh, you're working well over there. And uh, every time I go past that QTH yours, mate, and I see that antenna up there, I just shake my head. I was showing one of our, our inspectors at work. He's uh, He's got his full call and uh, he said it and he nearly fell off the seat when he said it he went Jesus Christ he said I didn't even realise that was there how was he getting away with that I said ah, I said he's, he's well God knows how he's doing it I said but he used to have something like that with his, uh, with his van so alright Jeff no worries bud nice to meet you catch you again soon mate yeah take it easy uh, uh, Dave and um, yeah the rumbling joke was was funnier for me because of the fact of your uh, of your Star Trek fetish uh, it just fitted perfectly, but uh, yeah, there you go. And as for the beam, um, yeah, it took me a lot of years to get it up there, uh, Dave, messing around with the uh, council and uh, and planning and all that sort of stuff. And uh, it it probably took me the best part of eight years altogether to actually get it up legally. So um, yeah, let the rest dream on, mate. Well, yeah, good stuff, mate. Yeah, it's getting a bit like this at my house at the minute with all the aerials up. But hey ho, I'm. Uh, Planning on putting another one up. I'll just have to wait for the missus to go. All right, no worries, bud. You crack on. As I say, I'll just keep talking for England on here. I've, uh, I'm a bit renowned for it. But <laughs> Take it easy, Trev. Nice to hear you, mate. You never know. We might be uh, on here a little bit more often. Yeah, it's certainly a nice place to come and chat and out the way and uh, no QR and what have you. And uh, not much chance of people invading your privacy. But, uh, yeah, there you go. Yeah, talking of antennas, I was just about to go out and put a... Um, uh, a homebrew uh, slinky dipole up for uh, for old band Stigy. Um, I can't remember that be bothered now, but um, yeah, I might see you uh, elsewhere when I'm uh, up and running on it. Uh, Dave, seventy three's mate, or bye bye ten ten whoosh and all that stuff. TTFN ten ten till we do it again. Ta ta for now. Yeah, catch you in a bit, bud. Ta ta. See you, bye. Bye, Trev. A bit. Oh, brilliant! Absolutely brilliant, Gary. That just uh, cracked me up. <laughs> A full out, mate, after all these years. A blast from the past, wow. I told you, every time I put a notice on, mate, come and join in. And it's a bit of a shame, really, that you have to put posts on, on the internet to get people to come and do things like this nowadays. But, you know, the internet is a powerful tool for getting people together, mate, especially on the radio. Um, and as I say, it's, it's just, you know, but that's the most activity that's been on FM in this town in... What, 20 years? 15 years? Yeah, wow. It's, uh, hmm. Certainly a blast from the past. Yeah. Wow. Certainly is. Anybody else with us? Nope, I sent Stuart a message just letting him know, but he's, uh, he's not come and joined us. Go 